Hi, I'm Kathy Flood, and I'm studio number eight on the Chatham Studio Tour. Happening the first two weekends in December, um, I will only be open the first weekend. But when you come on the tour, you'll see many of my watercolors and large acrylic abstracts. I like to paint fruits and vegetables and teach my students how to do so. On this wall, you'll see two large acrylic abstracts that I created for this long hallway in my home. But these paintings are now for sale. And here's a portrait of my dog, Sandy. I love to paint dogs and cats. And it's kind of fun to dress up your bathroom for the holidays with some neat artwork and a fun shower curtain. And here I've painted two pieces of coral in a bright ultramarine blue. Blue is my favorite color, so you kind of see it throughout uh, my paintings. Now we're going upstairs to the art studio. And here's where I conduct all my classes. I teach watercolor and drawing. And here's a little section that shows some of the demos that I do with my students. And I bought a bunch of ribbon. In case you would like to buy a holiday gift, I'll wrap it with some pretty red ribbon. Here's a Galloway cow that I painted. Um, this one is actually sold. And here's a large watercolor abstract. And another Galloway. And my sister's dog that's in progress, a graphite drawing. And here's a Fayetteville sheep that I dressed up with a little wreath. And some trees. And holly. All in watercolor. Just ready for you to give as a gift or keep for yourself. And here's another large abstract. And I also have some smaller ones, perfect for a beach house. And I have some little demos that I'm selling for $5. Next is a tree that I painted after a recent visit to Jefferson, North Carolina. I call it Jill's Fraser Fir and a pine cone. If you stop by the studio, I'll tell you the story behind the pine cone. Next up is a triptych that I created with acrylic paint. Um, it was an interesting process. I was really happy with the results. I wanted some neutral colors to cover a big space. And I will explain the whole process to you if you stop by the studio. I think this piece is, would be interesting in your home or office. It's a great conversational piece, and there's just lots to see. And here's some more holly that I painted. I have holly growing out front and decided to paint that. And a graphite drawing of pine cone. If you stop by, I will tell you the story behind the pine cone too. Here's some florals. I picked up some flowers at Trader Joe's. I also took flower pictures in my neighborhood. And I love to paint them and teach other people how to do it too. This is a gardenia that I did on toned paper with chalk and graphite. And here's some more florals. They're all originals. There are no prints in my tour this year. And here's some paintings of some boats that I saw on a trip to Martha's Vineyard. And here's a main lighthouse. 
This is a large watercolor that I created, and it is right now at the Art Center in Carborough, North Carolina. However, it will be back in my studio in time for the tour this weekend. So I hope to see you either December 4th or 5th. I'm studio number eight on the Chatham Studio Tour. You can get a map at local businesses or at chathamstudiotour.org.